Today we'll be discussing why lipase is the superior biomarker for diagnosing acute pancreatitis compared to amylase. Lipase offers higher sensitivity and specificity, making it a more reliable indicator of acute pancreatitis. It rises rapidly, typically within 3 to 6 hours of symptom onset, and peaks around 24 hours. Unlike amylase, which normalizes within 3 to 5 days, lipase remains elevated for up to 2 weeks. This extended elevation allows for accurate diagnosis, even in cases of delayed presentation, enhancing its clinical utility. In specific scenarios, such as hyperlipidemic or alcoholic pancreatitis, lipase proves particularly valuable. In these cases, amylase levels can remain normal, potentially leading to missed diagnoses. Lipase, however, reliably detects pancreatic injury regardless of these underlying conditions, ensuring patients receive timely and appropriate care. Current clinical guidelines and evidence strongly support the use of lipase alone for diagnosing acute pancreatitis. Co-testing with amylase is no longer recommended, as it adds minimal diagnostic benefit while increasing unnecessary healthcare costs. By focusing on lipase, providers can streamline testing, reduce expenses, and maintain diagnostic accuracy. In summary, lipase's superior sensitivity, specificity, and prolonged elevation make it the preferred biomarker for acute pancreatitis, particularly in complex or delayed cases. Its use aligns with evidence-based guidelines, optimizing patient care and resource utilization.